good evening. Uh, welcome to the Public Works Parks Recreation Environment Committee of what is today? Wednesday, April 14th, 2021, 5 30 p.m. I will read uh, what I need to read at the beginning. We are being broadcast live stream today on HBA TV Comcast and Frontier Government Channels 96 and 6032. It will also be streamed via hpatv.org, the HPA TV Facebook page, and HPA TV's Roku TV, Apple TV, and Amazon TV apps. It will be rebroadcast and made available on the HPA TV YouTube channel. Uh, with uh, us this evening, uh, I am the chair, Marilyn Rossetti, Councilman Marilyn Rossetti. With us this evening is Councilman Nick LeBron and John Gale. Councilman John Gale is not with us this evening. We have a full agenda, one agenda item, but a very important agenda item. It's uh, uh, Mayor Bronin with company res resolution reconfirming the, confirming, not reconfirming, confirming the reappointment of Brian Gallagher, the now, uh, who is the chair of the uh, Parks and Recreation Advisory Committee and the appointment of Naisha McCauley as the representative to Pratt from the Friends of Bushnell Park. Is that correct, Charmaine? No, it's not. It, it ought know. to be, and uh, we will rewrite in the report. Yeah, it's I'll the, put Bushnell Park Foundation. Okay, thank you. So let uh, so the minutes will reflect that. Thank you. All right. Um, so uh, what what we normally do is uh, we start with uh, people. Uh, you know, you, you, we have your resumes. Um, so if you'd like to say, I, we'll start with Naisha. Say a little bit about you know why you're here. And then if my colleague, Councilman LeBron has any questions, he will ask you, I will. And then we'll do the same thing with uh, 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 Brian Gallagher. And so Naisha, you have the floor. Thank you, Councilwoman Rossetti. And uh, good evening, uh, Councilman uh, LeBron. Thank you for uh, this opportunity to, uh, to speak. Um, as the resolution states, I'm um, a representative, I'm a board member of the Bush Bushnell Park Foundation and um, am, um, will through this would then serve as a representative on PRAC um, as the representative of the Bushnell Park Foundation. I joined the Bushnell Park Foundation board uh, last year, um, and um, I'm very happy that um, I'm serving on that board because, uh, as you both know, I'm a lifelong resident of Hartford, and so Bushnell Park, of course, uh, for everyone who lives in the city um, and visiting, for that matter, Bushnell Park is a near and dear uh, to, to all of us because it it's our, like, mini Central Park, if you will. Yeah! Uh, <laughs> <laughs> um, but also, uh, Bushnell Park is my neighborhood park. I live just a few blocks away, so that's the park that um, my children and I go to as our neighborhood park. So um, we're invested in, in the health and well-being of Bushnell Park for all of those reasons, but also just because we are, uh, we're Hartford City residents and Bushnell Park is so... Um, important to the health and well-being of the entire city. So I, I really um, uh, am proud to serve on the Bushnell Park Foundation as a board member, but also equally uh, excited about being a representative um, to um, in serving um, as a, I don't know, it, would I be serving as a commissioner on PRAC? Some of these things get get hard to to understand. Yes, the... you will be a commissioner. Okay. <laughs> your main duty is the Bushnell Park Foundation rep foundation. to report on those issues and bring it back to the foundation. Thank you, Charmaine. And, and um, thank you. Thank you. Let it be noted also for anyone who may listen to this afterwards that uh, I did not mean to be overly familiar with Ms. Cauley. I, I consider her. Uh, colleague and a friend, so I did call her by her first name. So please, and Brian, I I don't want to think I am that's in any way not respectful. But I, you know, for people who don't know that I've known them a long time and consider them friends. So, um, um, 
thank you, first of all, as we say to everyone who wants to serve uh, any place in this city, and I believe our attorney is with us now. Um, um, I don't see him or her. They were supposed to be a representative, but I don't see. Uh, Mr. Osborne is oh, Yes. On. Yep, yep, there you are. Okay. Um, I apologize about that, sorry. That's okay. It's okay. So we're 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 all legal now. So we can just act crazy because we'll have uh, representation. So thank you again. We say all the time. Anybody who wants to serve, and particularly as as you know, our parks are you know so important to the city, to the health of a city, to you know families, children. So Councilman LeBron, do you have anything to ask of uh, Ms. McCall? I don't have anything to ask. I just wanted to make a comment uh, through you, Madam Chair. Yes. Um, you know, Naisha McCauley is someone that I've known for over 10 years. Uh, started as a professional capacity, but I also consider her a friend. Uh, Ms. McCauley has been dedicated to Hartford community in many, many different ways. And I'm not surprised that she's also invested in our parks. Um, and so uh, she is definitely someone whose opinion is, uh, is very valid but someone who, who will also uh, bring to the PRAC Commission a sense of uh, humility and also like uh, a calmness. She has a calm spirit about her, even when she's tackling uh, uh, critical conversations, <laughs> and I admire that the most. And so with that being said, I uh, put a motion on the floor to favorably uh, vote for uh, Naisha McCauley to uh, the vote. Uh, they're in one resolution, uh, Attorney Osborne. Can we do those together or? Okay. I don't know if he's listening to me. I, I, um, excuse me, repeat the question. The the resolution there, there uh, Brian Gallagher and Naisha McCauley are in it together. Do we need a motion for each one or can we, what, after we dis have a discussion with Brian Gallagher, make a motion on the two people together and then put it forward as one? Um, I, 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 I believe we could we could do it together or separate. Um, e, e, they're both on the agenda. I, I, I believe it encompasses uh, what's on the agenda. I believe. Uh, okay. Yeah. Nick, do you want to just do it as one? Yeah, I'll do it as one. So I'll withdraw okay. that motion. All right. Um, and wait. Sorry for jumping the gun. No, no, that's okay. I just I, I think it's smoother if we just have it in one. Okay. So thank you, thank you, Naish, and again, uh, echo the sentiment. So. Uh, Brian Gallagher, um, again, he is, it's a reappointment to PRAC. Um, I know Brian has served as the chair for the last year, I believe. Did you take over the chair? I know for you, it may have seemed like a hundred years, but um, you're, you, I think you became the chair right, right after I got elected, correct? Yes. Yep. Okay. So uh, just to really uh, drive home the point, uh, Brian's here today from a park um, coaching. So he, he wants to just add the drama to his, uh, his um, whole presentation. So Brian, um, we have your resume and certainly, you know, we know your work. So maybe you might want to say a little something about your reappointment. Um, hello, thank you everybody uh, for having me on tonight. Um, really appreciate it. Yeah, I joined PRAC, um, I think in 2014, I'm not even really sure um, because I, I uh, was running youth sports in Hartford and I wanted to have a voice for the youth um, in the parks on the board. Um, and that's kind of been the focus of mine since I've been on. And then I uh, was the uh, vice chair for a year. And then last year I became the chair um, of PRAC to just keep on pushing, um, pushing the parks and pushing youth and families in the parks, um, especially. Um, I run um, Active City, which is a, a youth sports nonprofit in Hartford, working with other youth programs and the city to provide uh, sports for kids in Hartford. Um, that's why I'm here at the field right now. We actually have soccer practice tonight. Um, and, and then I'm also a teacher in Hartford. I'm a lifelong Hartford resident. Um, I have three little kids who play in the parks. Uh, we spend a lot of time in them. And so uh, they're you know, very close to my heart. Thank you, Brian. Thank you. And again, as I said to uh, uh, Naisha Pauly, Naisha. thank you. We thank you for your time. We thank you for your efforts. And, you know, PRAC is a, is a, you know, great advisory commission and it, it does good work. So Councilman LeBron, any comments? For you, Madam Chair, 
guys have a comment. Um, so I've known Brian um, as long as I remember. Grew up with Brian, consider him a friend. But beyond that, Brian has been a very selfless person. At times, I think he needs to be a little bit more selfish. But he's so selfless and uh, gives so much time back to the youth in our community. Um, obviously, he's heavily invested in soccer, but a lot of people don't know behind the scenes how much he's involved with other sports and helping other people. He's really been the glue, as long as I've known him, to keep community-based youth, community-based organization connected to city affairs, city policy when it comes to youth and recreation. And, you know, Brian has opened up fields for folks you know, on Sundays, uh, countless nights, um, early mornings, um, just someone whose uh, dedication uh, and passion uh, uh, for the youth. We're, we're, lo we're losing you, Nick. Your heart in terms of the beyond uh, compare. So, um, yes. Yep. Yes. All right. So with that okay. being said, Yes, I'll, I'll, be, I'll put a motion on the floor All right. to, to nominate both Brian and Naisha uh, to the, uh, as commissioners to the, uh, to the PRAC board. Okay, and I'll second it. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Okay, motion passes. So thank you. Uh, we're very excited. And uh, as our agenda states, uh, other business, I do not believe there is any other business at this time. We thank you for your time. Uh, we have a motion to adjourn. Motion to adjourn. So move. So thank you. Thank you, Attorney Osborne. Thank you, Charmaine. Thank you, HPA TV. Talk to you later. Bye. Bye. Good evening, guys. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you, everybody. Thank you.